a vlog. I just got a package in the mail. I'm excited because, yeah, I got the uh, self reflection cards by We're Not Really Strangers. Decided to get this. Oh, it's reflected. Decided to get this because my friend Raf has been answering one question from the deck on his Vlogmas. And I thought it was something cool and fun and, you know, I'm a sucker for self-reflection. So I bought it. <laughs> Inside, we're all the same. <laughs> I had to admit, um, We're Not Really Strangers has really good branding. Okay, finally got it. Should I, uh, should I do a question? <laughs> I was kind of scared. Oh boy, okay. Ah, uh, yes. <clears throat> card that I pulled says, What's my favorite song at the moment? Why do I love it so much? I play it for myself. I already played it today. <laughs> but, uh, my favorite song at the moment is Good Days by SZA. Yes, I'm one of those bitches. <laughs> but, I kid you not, for the past however long it's been out, I wake up and the song plays in my head. Why do I love it so much? Because I love SZA. She hasn't put out music in a while and I love that song. It's the soul, you know? <laughs> but I also like the message that uh, I need more good days in here. You know? I guess I'll do these cards every once in a while in a vlog when I want to add some spice. <laughs> so, <laughs> I asked my Instagram a while ago about Crocs and what they thought of Crocs. And a lot of people think Crocs are in, but the Crocs that I want, the these ones, they're kind of expensive. So, I don't know. I'm waiting for them to go on sale before I buy them, but I do want them. You know, as I'm, I'm, I'm looking at these Crocs, I see these. A lot of people have opinions on Skechers too, but these look like some shoe that like Balenciaga would do. And they're on sale? Bitch, I might impulse buy these right now. I know people have opinions on Crocs and Skechers, but honestly, if I learned anything in my 20, almost 26 years of life is, I don't give a fuck anymore. If I think it looks cool, I'm gonna fucking do it. Because it's my life. It's my money. I can spend it however I want. I'm not gonna do a girl, I'm just thinking about it. I actually might do it. I did it. <laughs> Hello, vlog. I finished filming my thread up thrift haul earlier. I am taking a break from editing it. Should be quick, but hopefully I can get it up next week. Oh, sorry if you can hear my housemate. He's on the phone with someone for work, but yeah. Decided to maybe pull another one of these self-reflection cards and uh, we can answer one together. So here we go. Do a little shuffly shuffle. Pick one. Ooh. <laughs> okay, this one says, what do I have to offer in a romantic relationship? And what do I want to receive? <laughs> this question's kind of funny because I got out of a long-term relationship a few months ago. And um, I learned that I have a lot to offer in a romantic relationship. I have always been that person that just like loves the idea of love and like loves being in love. So when I love someone, like I love unconditionally and with everything that I have, like I, I give a lot of myself to nurturing the relationship. And sometimes I forget to set my boundaries and ask for things that I need because I get lost in wanting to make the relationship work. Like I, I'm definitely a fighter. Like I'll do everything I can to make something work before I give up on something. Yeah, like I, I give a lot physically, mentally, emotionally, physically, like I put my all into a relationship. And you know, with my past relationships, I want to receive more. <laughs> um, just kind of plainly put, I think I, I deserve more. I deserve to have the same energy that I bring be brought back to me. I want to feel loved. I want to feel more emotionally connected. Because even with my friendships, 
we're all very open with one another. I want that same level of openness and communication and emotional vulnerability in a relationship. Like a nice, well-rounded, fulfilling relationship is what I want to receive. <laughs> Basically someone that can like meet me at the same energy level that I offer in a romantic relationship because it sucks being the person giving more in a relationship and then like realizing that you like haven't gotten what you need back. That's my answer on that. Vlog. I just I just got a package. Sorry, I'm really close. Hello. <laughs> just got a package. It's my sketchers. <laughs> Kinda cool. I'm gonna put them on. I'm gonna put them on. Hold on. I approve. These are cool. Good purchase. Morning vlog. It is Sunday morning. Um, today is chore day. Got a lot of chores to do. I have to clean my bathroom and then mop and sweep the floors in the kitchen because that's my assigned house chore um and then i have to vacuum my room do some laundry so uh yeah watch me do some chores doing all my chores I figured I should do a room tour since it's all clean now uh, there's not much so let's just let's just do it since why not <laughs> let's see oh there we go <laughs> so I got you on the wide angle but so this is what you see when you enter my room it's really not much it's pretty plain I haven't put anything on the walls I've lived here for about like half a year now, but this is when you walk in, this is the door. It's my mirror. I think it's from Ikea. My bags. I have a little corner with all my makeup. And then my desk is here. My bed. I have a Floyd platform bed. Sorry, I don't make my bed. <laughs> so it's a little messy. And then on this side, I have my beautiful Monstera that revived after, you know, being really sad because I repotted it and it didn't like the soil. And then over here I have this makeshift shelving that I just have a bunch of miscellaneous junk in. Um, yeah, there's just like a lot of crap in there, but this lamp that I got from Facebook Marketplace for only like 15 bucks. Uh, my tripod, <laughs> a resistance band, my fiddly fig, a little plant stand from Ikea with miscellaneous things. And I got a rose quartz lamp. And then this is my bed. Yes, I still have a pillow pet. It's a koala. Um, my dying syngonium plant. And then over this side I have this dresser that I got from Wayfair, Ikea, just some candles and some jewelry stuff, and then some plants, um, my Switch that I don't play anymore, some scrunchies, 
my fan. Uh, so I picked up this habit of sleeping with my fan on now. Um, yeah, so I, I sleep with a fan on every night now. And then this is my little desk setup. It's just a really small laptop desk from Ikea. And then just a chair from Facebook Marketplace. It's not like the most comfortable chair, but it's one of those like fancy or like trendy mid-century modern chairs. It's, a, it's an okay setup for now. I, I really don't care. <laughs> and plus, I leave all this space here for activities. And, and by activities, I mean exercising. <laughs> and this is my closet. It's uh, kind of a mess right now, but yeah, it's a pretty big closet. Linens and stuff. And then just random shit, my shoes, my clothes, yeah, and all this, haven't really been able to wear it because pandemic, but you know, it's a pretty big closet, I have a lot of stuff, and this is me paring everything down, like there's a giant trash bag here full of clothes that I want to donate, <laughs> so, but yeah, this is my room tour, let me show you a 360 one more time <laughs> mm -hmm. room door it's quite nice there you go so i don't know how that long this vlog is now but just in case i will say see you later for now and then uh, i'll see you in my next vlog so Thank you for watching. I hope you have a great day, night, wherever you are. I'll see you in my next video. Bye.